Hey, what's up, people? It's me again, Jeremy. Just want to show you some progress on these raised straw bale repurposed beds that I've created. Got some cool stuff going on in here. Looks like somebody got in there to dig. Can't stop all the critters from getting at the garden. But hey, I think everything's looking pretty well. Got some nice little tomato plants in here. I forget what these red things are. Forgive me for forgetting. Uh, I thought they might be cumin that I had some seedlings of, but it might be cranberry hibiscus. So I'm going to have to keep a close eye on that. And if it is the hibiscus, that stuff's prolific and it'll probably just take over this whole bed and choke out the roots for the tomatoes and all the herbs that I got going in there. If you look closely down here, you'll see some little basil seedlings and some dill that I planted all the way around in a circle to kind of keep the pests away. They don't typically like those kind of herbs. Moving on to the next one. Not sure which is which or what's what yet, but I planted some watermelon in here. I think that's the bigger ones and some squash and some peppers um, not so much going on but it's still early this was only done a few days ago and over here I've got some corn going and I think that might be what that is right there but I'm still not sure and then I if you look real closely here right here those are scallions, green onions, that I used uh, and took the white parts with the roots and stuck them right in here a few inches down, or an inch or so down, and they're already starting to pop up and regrow. So green onions there, I believe these are white sweet onions. I've also got some corn in here. Like I said, I think that's what that might be. That might be, that might be. Still too early to tell. I'm not very good at identifying things in the very beginning if you've looked at my other videos. Um, as far as my Back to Eden plot that is around this, acting as a weed barrier, there's still some little weeds coming up here and there, but I'll pluck those out as I need to. I went in here yesterday and planted some large pumpkins in these holes here. Just quickly cover those up. I forgot to do it yesterday. Looks like there might be a tomato coming up there. Kind of a random tomato. But uh, some large pumpkins in the middle that'll vine out. And all the way around this thing, a whole bunch of butternut squash. I don't see any sprouts yet. Like I said, I did this yesterday, but it should only take maybe a couple of days to pop up from there. Nice fertile ground underneath these wood chips of some compost manure and a little bit of amendments, organic amendments. I still need to figure out how to put this border around here a little better so some of these nutrients don't leach out as quickly. But you get the idea, you know, I'm just creating another experiment here. Might get some landscaping border, that black stuff and just redo the whole edge of it. But yeah, I mean, uh, everything's looking pretty good. We had a bunch of rain here for a few days straight, so I shut off my sprinkler timer and put it on a delay, a rain delay. It allows me to do 24 or 48 hour rain delays. But uh, all in all, I mean, everything's looking good. Um, no complaints. Maybe a little slower growing this way because when you do the straw bell gardening, you put the straws facing upwards so it catches nutrients and water whereas this is just kind of piled in there all different ways um, so it'll take a little while for the roots to set into that what's underneath this top layer of soil but everything's getting water through these soaker hoses everything's looking good and I'm liking what I'm seeing so far anyway I want to show you my little spot here I'll probably get some more straw bales soon. Uh, it's not yet fall, it's still kind of in the heat of summer, so I'm gonna hold off on starting my fall garden 
in a straw bale because I don't want anything to die off and trying to be mindful of the season. But this is looking good, so uh, so far so good, and I'll uh, send another update soon. Y'all have a good one. Peace.